Hi there, this is the Tartakova trap in the Dracula Frankenstein and it's from the game Tartakova against Spielmann 1907. After e4 and e5, white plays the Vienna game with knight c3, black responds with knight f6. Now after bishop c4, black can play this Dracula Frankenstein idea with knight takes on e4, temporarily giving up a piece because if white recaptures... Uh, with knight takes e4, then d5 forks the bishop and the knight, and black recovers the material with a fine game for black. So white doesn't have to take on e4. White can take on f7 first and then capture on e4. Or white can try queen h5, a direct approach, threatening checkmate on the move and ignoring this knight on e4. Well, black is going to defend by dropping the knight back to d6 which defends f7 as well as hits the bishop on on c4. And white really doesn't get too much after queen takes on e5 because queen e7 for black would ensure probably at least equality for black. So white's going to prefer to ma maintain pressure by dropping the bishop back to b3. After knight c6, white can try a tactical shot, knight b5, which is called removing the guard or the defender, the knight on d6 is defending that mate threat on f7. So by challenging that knight with knight b5, white threatens knight takes d6 and queen takes f7 mate. Black will defend by g6, hitting the queen, sending the queen back to f3. And the queen again is threatening f7 after knight takes on d6. Black should defend with f5 and this occurred in the famous spectacular game ost hansen against john nunn 1974 in john nunn's student days where white will continue with queen d5 and black went on to win that game if instead though of f5 black tries knight to f5 it has some logic behind it in that it frees up the d pawn to come forward and the knight wants to in some variations, head back to h6 to defend f7. Well then, after that move knight f5, white's going to hit the knight with g4, and black's already close to losing. In the game Tartakova against Spielman, Spielman tried a6 here. After a6, then um, white's going to be close to winning after g takes on f5, a takes on b5. They've both captured each other's knights, but f takes on g6, threatens mate now on f7. And after queen e7 defending, g takes f7 and king d8 leaves white far better. So after g4, after g4, sorry, g4, if the knight drops back to h6, then rather than play d3 with the idea of bishop takes knight, um, black could respond and hold the position with f6. So rather than d3, better for white is g5. And the knight back to f5 will allow now queen d5. Again, the same idea of mate on f7. And because after if queen e7 defending, now knight takes on c7, wins the exchange for white after king d8 and knight takes on a8. So this has been the Tartakova trap in the Dracula Frankenstein. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.